So, to begin, how to update action plans that are online. Click on Tutor Draws. Scroll down a little so that you can see the full menu with all of the options here. Click on Action Plans and then click on Post Observation Action Plan. Scroll down. And we can see here this number 64 means that there are 64 records or action plans in place waiting to be populated or have been partly populated already. To view these, click on this option here, View Grade All Submissions. Let's scroll down a bit. Here at the top we can see we have an A to Z index for names beginning with these letters of the alphabet. This is the first name search and here on the second row these are the surnames. So in order to populate an action plan or to update it, what you must do is find the person that you wish to update. So let's go for K for Nadia Kier in this example. And we'll scroll down. Okay, here is Nadia Kier. Now, what you must do is click on this edit button here and then click on edit submission and scroll down. Okay, we can see that the form is here in this box. However, it doesn't give us much scope to move around. So what we need to do is we need to expand this toolbox here. To expand the toolbox it's always this first tool on the far left of the first row of tools. If we click this you can see that now we have three rows, rows of tools. To expand this box here we simply click on the four-headed arrow and the tooltip says that it's toggle full screen mode. So click. And then we can see here that this person has been updated. So this is where you would map the actions and the progress etc. of where that person is up to in the process. Once you have added text to any of these boxes, just close that window, ignore that, you then must have, you must shrink the screen back down. And when you've done that, you can then simply click on Save Changes here. If, for example, you were in this screen here, and you didn't have the three rows of tools, simply click on this button here, toggled, toolbar toggle, and you can see that this button appears. And it's this one that will shrink the screen back down, and it's only at this point will you be given the option to save the changes. It's important to save the changes because any updates that you've made will be lost if you do not click the Save Changes button at this point. So I'm going to click on Save Changes and it really is as simple as that. 
When you upgrade um, update an action plan, the tutor will receive a message to say that the action plan has been updated. They can add to their own action plan, but they can only ever see their own. They can't see anybody else's. However, in your role, you will be able to see all of the records. And then to get back to the main menu, click this green button here. And now you can see that you are back to the A to Z menu. Thank you for watching this video tutorial.